Oh, Rick, they're not going to hire us to be the new voice actors for Rick and Morty. Oh, Morty, that's, they don't like Bindigo very much. They don't like us. It's all, we're not going to get hired. That's right, Rick and Morty Season 7 has been leaked, and we have no idea who are going to be the voice actors. It's definitely not going to be Justin Roiland. It's definitely not going to be your man Z from Our Views Will Kill You, even though I do a damn good, damn good Bendigo, Rick, and Morty. Could have helped them out, but they chose not to go that direction. Let's see exactly what they're saying. It's been announced what the seasons are so what do we got here we got us some rick and morty rick and morty season seven release schedule ahead of the episodes officially announced are you in are you out do you want to watch this the co-creator and lead actor justin roiland exits the show and all of his characters are set to be recast even though all of the charges were dismissed. We talked about it up here. What's the issue? Don't know, but it looks like you're not a fan of making money. That would be my guess. Rick and Morty was already in decline with its writing, so now is it going to go down even further without its main actor? They talk about it. It's a YouTube thing. Summer and Beth announce it and they are just nobody wants this a seth or uh beth and summer they're like oh what if we bring back gearhead and what if we bring back that no don't care oh they're like can't we just have like a normal sitcom where like one of us just gets like food poisoning or something not interested in any of that not at all not even remotely interested. I like the be uh, I like their characters and I like the voice actors, but you get yourself a summer episode and you get somebody who is tuning out with a lot of other people, not super interested. And what's weird is if you look at the description, it's like it's not going to be a low stakes sitcom. Okay, they even say it in the thing. It's gonna be oh this the the season's gonna be there's gonna be a real low bar for the season. Okay, folks, you guys do you. They're going to have mid-breaks. Uh, it looks like there's going to be an October 22nd premiere, even though it says it's going to debut on October 15th. A little confusing. You know, the Rick and Morty schedule has been all over the place. Nobody exactly knows what they're going to do. In season six, they took a month-long break. Uh, season four took almost six months break. Like, ah, uh, who knows? But apparently, they're gonna say it's gonna, it's gonna, they're gonna release it with weekly chapters, no hiatuses, no breaks. Okay, October fifteenth, episode one. How Poopy got his poop back? Not gonna be good. The Jerick trap because obviously they still have the voice, the the Jerry voice actor. So that's October twenty seventh. Air Force Wong, that's a Morte, Unmork Rickton, Rick Fending Your Mort, Wet Kuat, a Mortican Summer, Rise of the New Mem New Bear Numbericons, jeez, Mort Ragnarick, and Fear No Mort. I don't know, folks. Not super exciting, like I don't know how people feel about I mean, he literally voiced the majority of the cat like almost all the characters. So I'm not super excited about this. I'm going to watch it. I'll review it. I'll let you know what I think. We reviewed all the Rick and Morty's. If you want to see any of that Rick and Morty action, we got it all because we've been fans from the beginning, but now it's starting to make some doubts. First of all, Dan Harmon, you can't have two episodes about the story train, about how awesome you are at writing stuff. You just can't. It's not a thing. I refuse to accept it. You're not that good of a writer. You got kicked off community and you failed at Rick and Morty. What else have you done? You're not some kind of genius. I haven't seen anything else. You haven't put out anything else. You're real good at getting divorced. 
you're also pretty good at getting me too'd. You just happened to get me too'd before me too, and then Justin Roiland got me too'd during me too, but had all the charges dropped. Just pointing that out, just saying you don't want to get rid of a good thing. Seems like it makes sense. Let me know in the comments below what you think. What is going on here? Are you going to watch season seven? Are you even going to give it a shot? Yes? No? Maybe so? Let me know. Just say yes, no. It's fair enough. But if you like what you hear here, we have an audio podcast. iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify. Free to you. Live stream, Friday nights, YouTube, the greatest. We're here, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Friday nights, come join the party. Join the action. Promise you'll enjoy it. But I'm on to the next one.